Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Just thought we'd have a sleep and wait till morning. There we go. Beautiful morning. Good morning, Arthur. Oh, hello there. Oops. So, we found the old Driscoll's hideout, but no sign of coal. Well, so long as we're hitting them before they hit us. Oh, and that chair? He's all right now. One night when I was frisky. Okay. I'm all right. So you're just going to walk off while I'm talking to you? All right. Fair enough. Morning, Arthur. You missing your tree yet? I feel like chopping it down. We'll all be watching you. Anyway, I won't disturb you. Yep, all right, man. I'll see ya. All right. Let's see what we need to do. this Mary Linton uh, next to my bed just before I fell asleep I found a letter so I opened the letter and it was from this Mary Linton and it says you know she's went off got married did her own thing and then apparently she see me when I took me and uh, stinky took the uh, girls into the town into Valentine she saw us then so yeah let's uh, see what she's got to say where's my horse there he is I live on a moderate diet hmm. Apparently there's another mission, but where's that? Alright, we've got... Poirier Square To rescue Sean from the bounty hunters in Blackwater Okay And we've also got... Micah, get him out of jail in Strawberry Beautiful Hey Bill, did you find much in the old Driscoll's cabin? We did all right out of it. Just no coal. <sighs> yeah. I was nowhere that close to your shoot, I was that barking. I don't really, I really don't like them shotguns. And then again, my right trigger really isn't helping on my controller. <coughs> Being broken and only working half the time. I have got one ordered. Is useless. Where's cat bomb repeater?
People really like going in front of you on this game. I actually put my gun away. <sighs> I don't want to get in trouble. Whoops. I'm just jumping over people's fences. Well, she's got the right idea of having a gun at the door. Collar for you. Get a bit of a drink. Hello, Arthur. Mary. Uh, I heard you and your friends was around. I. Okay. Where's what's his name? Died. I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, me too. Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So, uh, well, you've been... <clears throat> you've been made a widow and you come here looking for me, is that it? No, ain't like that, Arthur. Ah, okay. <coughs> Pardon me. I... My family. I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down on me? You want me to help? It's my little brother, Jamie. <laughs> oh, I always liked Jamie. At least compared to the rest of them. He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart? Don't make me beg you, Arthur. My money, my life, me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. Little Jamie's joined the Chelonians, that strange religious order. Good for him. They're quite mad, Arthur. They'll kill him. You're the only person he'd listen to. So, I'm too rough to marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to help me, but... But I think of you often. Long time ago now. I'm begging you, Arthur. I say let Jamie live Jamie's life, and not the nightmare that his daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. Touchy subject. Please, Arthur. Will you help me? Yes. Where is he? Somewhere out near Carmody Dell, I think. The rancher there said he'd seen him around the Cumberland Forest area. I just want him back, Arthur. If you find him, bring him to me at the station. I'll see what I can do. I'll owe you. You already owe me. Okay, boy. Let's go. So where are we gonna go? Really, all the way over there. It's a long way. <sighs> Let's go then, Shadow. Come on. Put that there. Oh, 
corner. The way the sun shines through. Yeah. Graphics on this get me every time. Truth be told, that fool always complaining. But does he do something about it? Man barely lifts his hand to wave the flies away, aside from to lift a drink, of course. Marriage for me has been nothing but trouble. But Biscuit, he was a fine animal. Loyal, smart, brave. Didn't take no guff, not from no one. Had one of them mountain boys pull a gun on me once? I was riding up near the Dakota and had stopped by a nice warm patch. Must have dozed off, but I wake up and find some nasty piece of work pointing a rusty shotgun straight at me. Well, he gets wheezing on and I must have made some sort of noise, because the next thing I know, Biscuit had nipped his ear clean off. Kicked his hide, too, as he was hollering away. Didn't think a man could run so fast. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah. Had a good laugh on that one. <laughs> I tell the husband, what does he do? Should have never gone over there, honey, he says. Gee, thanks. <coughs> so, you live at Emerald Ranch then? For the time being. I was looking for work. They was looking for some help with the gardens. If I waited any longer for my husband to put food on the table, I'd have died of starvation. I'll be moving on soon, though. Emerald Ranch, well, it's a strange place. How so? The owner's a mean bastard. Strange, too. The lights in bullying folk. There's a daughter, but she never leaves the house. You can see her in the window sometimes. When I asked about her, everybody told me to leave it alone. Found an old saloon there, all shut down now. But I went in to have a look, and there's bullet holes, old blood stains. Something definitely happened there, but I couldn't figure it. Just an uncomfortable feeling to the place. Either way, it's time I left. Especially now I lost that poor horse. I'll collect my belongings and be on my way. Back home? I guess. I bet my husband's right where I left him. Bottle in hand. Yeah. Oh, we're getting close now. Wanna be? Miles away from where I wanted to be. Here we go. This is great. She just gave me something. What she gave me? Appreciate it. Emerald ring. What a lousy day. Oh, now I've got to go all the way back. Come on then, Shadow, let's go. Fence up in.
go boy shadow go mom Slow down a bit. Whoa, Good boy. Let's give you something to eat, shall we? It's okay, boy. Speak to the boy. Arthur? Hello, son. Your sister is very worried. The boy has chosen a path, sir. The path to truth. Well, I mean, his sister just wants to speak with him. Arthur, I've chosen a path. The boy has chosen a path. He's chosen safety. What path have you chosen, sir? I don't know about this nonsense. Let me speak to the boy. Da, da, da. Are you always this negative and antagonistic, sir? I'm not I'm apologize. Man. Forgive me, please. <laughs> I am a fool for my God and a happy one, sir. I bless you. What do I dream about? Who are my heroes? I don't care who your heroes are. I have no idea. Uh, turtles. Yeah, turtles. Hey, you love turtles. I love them too. Jamie knows the truth, but of course, you may speak with him. Exactly. If your teachings are so great, what harm can I do? I'm... I'm not... I'm not coming with you, Arthur! Just come and speak with Mary, then make up your mind! Leave me alone, Arthur! I didn't ask for your help! No, put your gun away! Jeez. I will last area. Well, try to. Get out the way, Ram. Oh, where am I going? The wrong way. Uh, this isn't good. Yeah. 
Oh, I can see him in the distance. I'm gonna throw some water and get a bit of a clean. There we go. Come on, Shadow, you can do this. Where on earth is he going? Oh, just you wait till I get near you, youngin. Slowly press R2. Uh, wait there, I don't get it. What? What? I did not get that at all. <clears throat> Retry checkpoint. I warn you, Arthur. I'm. I'm gonna. I don't want to live anymore! Kid, just calm down. Leave me alone! Alright, slowly press to fill the meter. The more the meter is, the longer you get to aim. Lightly hold the R2 to begin drawing. Okay. Uh. What? Why is it not working? Should not take this long. Hold R2, which is what I'm doing. Right. Really? Did I shoot him or did he shoot himself? Right, I'm gonna get back to you when I've actually done it. I'm, I'm gonna... Oh, I'm back. Or you can just shoot yourself, get it over with. Come on. Alright, I'm holding it, so I've got a bit longer. Oh, and fully press it, which is what I did. Oh, finally! Oh. Let's go see your sister. Okay. That okay. took a hell of a lot longer than it should have done. It's annoying. Okay, kid. Have I been a terrible fool, Arthur? I don't know. I don't know enough about it. But one thing I do know. There ain't no shame in looking for a better world. <coughs> I miss you, Arthur. <clears throat> Are you and Mary sweet on one another again? Oh, no. That's all a long time ago, son. Idiot. All right, back to Mary with Jamie. This Hopefully this goes a hell of a lot better than me trying to draw a gun with my broken R2. You were a kid last time I saw you. Didn't try to kill yourself. You know, you taught me how to ride a horse. Too well, apparently. Shalonia, though? Really? You'd fall for that? They were very nice to me. They're decent. I'm sure. 
Please tell me you didn't give them any money. Of course I did. They rely on charitable donations. Jesus, Jamie, come on. I just wanted to believe that there might be something good coming my way one day. Guess that's dead in the water. With the turtle. Shut up. All Father kept telling me was, you won't amount to anything. You're not enough of a man. I had to get away. I couldn't take you anymore. Forgive me, but your father's a bully and a coward. Don't listen to him. Hey, don't talk about him like that. What do you want me to say, Jamie? He's a good father? Nice man? He won't be happy I saw you. Please send him my worst regards. <laughs> the thing is, he's right. I'm not good at anything. Come on, that ain't true. Tell me something you like. Um, uh, well, um... Uh, don't think too hard. Apples, I guess. Apples? Yeah, I love apples. Okay. I was thinking more along the lines of carpentry or horses or something. All right, go work in an orchard then. By that token, you must really like shooting and robbing people. I only like shooting young idiots who run away from me when I'm trying to help them. Father told me what you do. I'm sure he did. Hey, are you still with Dutch and what was his name? H Hester? Jose. Yep, still the same, sort of. And Annabelle and Bessie? I'm afraid they're dead. Shit. Maybe Mary did make the right choice. No doubt. But none of it is anything like the nonsense you read in the newspapers. So, are you two getting back together? Here we are. She must be waiting inside. We going in then? No, I thought I'd let you just wait outside. While I'm here, might be able to pay my bounty. Greetings, good to see you. Ready for a clean What is sleep? my bounty? We'll let our folks in there we go. Thank you, really. Jamie, Jamie, oh, come home, please. You've Father's been very sad. Father wouldn't know sadness if it died on his bed. But I'll come home for you. My boy. My sweet boy. Come on. Oh, Arthur. Thank you. Thank you. It's good to see you, Mary. And you, Arthur. And you. All that, and they're just going to get on the train and bugger up. Hmm. I've... You're... Oh, you'll never change. I know that. Oh, bless him. Feel gotta like feel bad for him. Luckiest man alive, and I feel like a fool. That woman confuses me and plays me for a fiddle like no one else alive. I trust I will not make a god awful fool of myself once more, but somehow I imagine I shall. Mission complete. Okay. I was in the army. Well. Let's see what else he's doing. Hmm. Going to the gunsmith. If it's open. Hello, sir. Good to see you. What can I do for you? 
Oh wait, you're that fellow who had to fight with Tommy outside of Smithfield? Mm -hmm. Yep. People are still talking about that fight. I ain't. Well, fair enough. Now there's Tommy. Anyway, how can I help you today? I need to give it a good clean. Um, let's see if we can fix. Well, not fix it. Obviously, just upgrade it. Iron sights. Okay, we'll have a bit of that. Scope. Yes, we'll have a scope on it. Stock. That doesn't do anything. And the wrap. Does that help in any way? No. I'm not bothered what it looks like. The wolf. Rosewood, wild cherry. I like I like wild cherry. I love some of that. Yes. Oh no, um, ammunition. nice locked and loaded trophy and okay low length that's already done about rifling it's already done iron sights it's already done on that one. The engravings. I can't even see. Just make sure I've got enough. Uh, varmint rifle. Can I do this? Uh, improves its range. I know I'm probably gonna end up using all my money, but if it makes my guns better, then it's worth it. scope that doesn't really do anything and wrap no I don't want to wrap on it styles 
Varnish. Where are you? Mahogany. Maple. Let's keep Miss Rosewood Wild Cherry. There we go. Suits me down to the ground. Oh, actually, ammunition. There we go, we've got enough of that. Double barrel shotgun. range okay that will do me that will do me very nicely thank you very much okay need to close it let's go I was gonna say that got dark quick what the hell I came here during the day and it's now 12.16am Nice Let's see if we can do a bounty Ooh. Well, look here Maybe this is our man You a bounty hunter, mister? Maybe It depends but I'm guessing you ain't here to pass the day, turn yourself in, or discuss the finer points of county law. <laughs> and I don't need to know much more than that, until I got a reason to. All right. You smell that? This here's a livestock town, mister. Attracts delinquents and reprobates like flies. Now, I'm not a fellow to pass a quick judgment. I've been around long enough to know you don't hire a saint to catch a sinner. You bring me what I need, and I'll pay you well, and I won't ask no questions. So, what is it you need? Why don't you have a look at that poster on the wall over there? He's a low-down huckster. He's been poisoning folks with his miracle cure from here to Ansburg. Killed more than Landon Ricketts without even pulling a trigger. Get some kind of... Sick satisfaction out of it. Feller over at the saloon says he thought he saw him by the gorge straight north of here. You think you can bring him in? The money's good. I need him alive, though. I want to make sure the women he witted get compensated before he swings. I'll see what I can do. Well, good luck to you. Mm, let's go get him. And we need him alive! That's an important point! Alive, I got it. Uh, I take it this is going to be real hot in the dark. Whoa. 
She is going away. Put she is going away. Are you Benedict Albright? Oh, sir. <coughs> uh. Kind of look like him. And I was told he'd be up here. No, uh, not me, sir. It's because I want to buy some medicine. <coughs> and uh, I heard, uh, oh, dear. I heard good things. I'll pay in gold if, if you can help me find him. It's just my mother's real sick. Oh, <laughs> well, if that's the case. For a sick woman, I'd be happy to help. <laughs> I'm a healer, you know? A medical man. Finest medicine in the state. <laughs> oh, <dear. laughs> Game's over, mister. Put your hands up. Take me in. Take me in? What for? Apparently, that's Duffy pushing his killer folk. There's a price on your head. I don't know. It ain't my business. Oh, partner, that's crap. I'm a healer. I got an aura. I speak to spirits. That I'm a scientist. Folks get real angry for no good reason. <laughs> You're a bird this, next. Can you fly? This is a mistake. Keep your hands up, buddy. They only want you for questioning. I have to insist that this is a mistake. Don't be a fool. Hold on. I'm slipping. Shit. Come on, get up. Uh, 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 you saved me! Now come on, buddy, let's make this easy. What, you're taking me in? It's just for question. Oh, hey, you saved my life! Ain't we had enough drama? I, I'd be better off jumping! Uh, oh, don't you dare tell me, I've just pulled him up, just from him to jump down again. Oh, this is about you. <sighs> don't jump! Or, or what? You can't shoot me now! Please. I'll take my chance. Come in! Uh, bye, friend! <sighs> really? Swim to the edge! Grab on to 
You better not die. Get over to the bank. <sighs> help! Help! Uh, please, throw me a rope. Come here. Come here. I think so somehow. Oh, get out of it, will ya? first what you got for me now I'm just gonna check your pockets oh, a miracle time platinum pocket watch thank you very much come on then you dopey Turn them in, I have to I carry them in and drop them into the empty cell. Okay. Shut up. Fortunate for you. I'm gonna get those blackouts sorted. This isn't necessary. I'm a medical man. A no, 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 no. Put it away. It's all just a big mistake. Oh, I don't feel very well. I told you to shut up. Who made you judge? I'm only in it for the money. Oh, I don't feel well at all. You're a bully, sir. Oh my lord, I wasn't expecting you back so soon. Uh, Mr. Elgort <coughs> was, uh, was just leaving. Sure. Yeah, of course he was. Where you want him? I'm selling the back. Okay. I'll drop him here. Oh, there's been some terrible mistake. I never did it. Any of it. I thought I told you to shut up, partner. But nothing. Shut up. And, uh, good luck. It's been real fun. You ain't much of a man. You ask folks for forgiveness, you remember this, partner? I've already forgotten. Now, sure, how much was you offered? Uh, $50. Here. Thank you. Madam. Now, please, remember what I told you. You can gain more bounty missions from the bounty posters found around the town. Oh, that's awesome. It's really good. Well, on that note, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please like and subscribe. And then, uh, 
Till then, I'll see you later.